Hello Robin. Okay, here's your tutorial. So I'm looking at uh, the spreadsheet for Robin's class, or not Robin's class, Megan's class, and I have all of her students here in column C. So I'm just going to go to the top one and highlight the whole collection and copy that. So there, and then I'm going to go into my email and instead of mail over here in the corner, I'm going to click and select contacts. When the contacts show up, then I want to go all the way to the very, very bottom where it says to create a new group. And I would call that Megan, that Megan Stricker, Stricker's class. And then once I create it, it puts it in my sidebar over here. So I need to go down the list and find Megan Stricker's class and click on it. Right now there's no contacts in this group, so what I'm going to do is click on the little plus a person to add people, and I'm going to paste that list in there that I copied. So I'll paste their names in, and I usually add the teacher's name too. Ah, you can tell I'm in the habit of U-C-K-E-R. And then I say add, and there they are. So the first thing that I usually do then is select them and send a test email to make sure that they get it and to make sure that they are able to respond to me and then um, we can go from there. Hope that helps.